Confrontations like this were a clear sign that the KKK demonstration could have erupted into violence at any minute. Security surrounding the march and the rally was tight. Officers from the College Park Police, the GBI, and the State Highway Patrol were out in force. Some were in full riot gear. Others surveyed the rally not only from the ground but from a cherry picker high above the crowd. Police separated the Klan demonstrators from the anti-Klan group with a cordoned off area at the courthouse. Anyone who appeared to be troublemakers were asked to leave. The only real threat of danger came at the end of the rally as Klansmen loaded a bus to leave. There was not enough room on the first bus and a rental truck was brought in to take the rest away. That meant the crowd of protesters would have time to get closer and confront the disrobed Klansmen face to face. A wall of police officers separated the protesters as the final Klan group boarded the truck and what police feared would be a violent clash came to an end with only two arrests on possession of weapons. From College Park, Vic Carter, WSB News.